What is going on, y'all? I'm Captain Jody with Bayou Bandit Charters. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new, hit that subscribe button. Woo! A little something different for the channel, y'all. Boy, she's rough out here today. We're gonna be shrimping today, y'all. We're out of Bayou La Battery, Alabama. You can see the casino boats probably way off in the background. Gonna be dragging my 16 foot net. It is very, very windy out here. Big, big swell, big waves, y'all. It's rough on this flat bottom. Woo! 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 Hopefully have some nice shrimp in the net for some blackened shrimp tacos. So let's see, y'all. We're gonna get out here, find a good spot, turn around downwind, let the old net out. Make a drag or two, see what we can do. Thank you, stay tuned. All right, I've got the motor running in neutral. I've got an extension on my kill switch so where I can reach the back part of the boat to work this net. But we've got the net, got my bridle tied on there. Hadn't been shrimping in a while, y'all. I'm excited about this. First thing we wanna do, I've got a tail buoy on mine. Just in case it gets hung up on something, I've got a lifeline to go back and get my net, pull it back the other direction. We want to get this bag, wet that bag a little bit. Let that mesh get a little softened up by that water. <clears throat> and we're going to tie the knot in the end of our bag here. What I like doing, y'all, is getting that rope go around twice like that, cinch it off and then make me some loops like this make one like that then go back the other way pull it through go back the other way pull it through do that several times and then it's real quick and easy to undo that bag when you've got a pressure of all the hopefully a lot of shrimp on there when i'm doing this by myself I want to drift downwind, put that net out, because it is a little rough out here today, y'all. Get that net out. You got to be real careful not to tangle up your boards or you'll have one heck of a mess. I like getting my <clears throat> starboard board out, get it laid over there my port board lay it right there you want to check and make sure you have no tangles you got this tickler chain it goes right in the middle y'all just like that you got your lead line i meant your float lines here goes to your floats your lead lines off the bottom tickler chain in the middle that's how you want to lay this net out. And what you do, you grab hold of your ropes. Spread them nets out a little bit. Hold on to them boards. Let them spread a little bit. Let them spread a little bit. Let them spread a little bit. Hold them and just bump that motor in gear. Keep them in my board spread out. Keep playing them lines out, making sure they don't cross. Feed them out, hold them a minute. Keep them board spread out. Just like so, y'all. Let her go. We're good to go, y'all. You want to go about 1.8 to 2 miles an hour is all you want. I don't know if the GoPro will show up or not, but we got some dolphins right here playing. Catching whatever's running on the outside of the net. Look at him playing right there around my net. We got two over there. We got two or three over there, one behind. We got about six or seven porpoises out here, y'all. Playing, eating fish. Man, they are living the life. 
out here off of Viola Battery, Alabama, y'all. See if we can get some Viola Battery shrimp. Hopefully we can. Boy, those dolphins are everywhere back there. They're smart animals, y'all. There's no worry about them getting tangled up in the net. They're smart. They know what's going on. They've seen it before. But they are absolutely everywhere back there behind the boat. I think I see eight, eight or ten. Oh, Captain Phillip going out to get in some shrimp this evening. That's a big boy right there, y'all. Pretty boat. Tell you what, guys. If y'all hadn't got you a pair of these fish 419 sunglasses you need to i'm telling you i love mine they cut through the glare the high definition polarization is awesome light as a feather stay in place they don't slide down my nose they're awesome y'all check them out fish 419 they got them in all different styles all different colors i like the green tint for inshore saltwater fishing and I like the clear frames with that little green stripe through them. Looks awesome. Lightweight. No scratches. I've been wearing them about two months now. Fit my face good. I love them, y'all. Check them out. Hopefully, we're going to have a net full of some nice shrimp. We'll see. We may not have anything, <laughs> but we're going to have a good time regardless. Stay tuned. All right, y'all. It's been 30 minutes. We're going to switch the motor off. Get back here and see what we have got. Hopefully, we got a bunch of shrimp. At least enough for some shrimp tacos. Blackened shrimp tacos. That sounds good, don't it? It is windy out here, y'all. Out here. Off of Biola Battery. and went over that's why i got 32 inch sides on this boat and it's self bailing so i don't have to worry about it Getting my workout today, y'all. Hopefully, we'll have some shrimp to show for it. All right. Finally made it to my boards. All right, get my starboard board up. Now for the port board. Woo! Woo, I'm tired, y'all. Oh. Ah. I'll get my lines. Oh. Come on, give me some shrimp. Maybe the shrimp gods will be good to me today. Whew. Ooh, I'm tired. Look at all the dolphins, y'all. They want a handout. You try to get all your fish 
catfish and crap like that down in the bag. Right on down to the bag. Ooh, we got birds. We got dolphins. But do we have shrimp? That is what we want to know. Do we have shrimp? I hear a lot of catfish. Oh, I see some nice shrimp, y'all. Oh, I see some nice, nice, big old shrimp, y'all. That's what we come for. That's what we come for, y'all. That right there is what we come here for. Don't you jump out of the boat. There we go, y'all. Look at that right there, y'all. Look at that. Look at the size of that shrimp in my hand, y'all. There's another one. And another one. And another one. Whoo, and another one. Oh, yes, sir. Those are white shrimp, y'all. See the green tail? It's white shrimp. That's what we came here to get for sure. Look at them pretty rascals. Yes, sir. Good drag. Woo, we gonna have some shrimp tacos. Let me tell you. Oh, we gonna have some shrimp tacos. Woo. I'm gonna get some of these old catfish out. Anything that'll hurt me. I'm gonna try to get out first. All right. Pretty shrimp, y'all. Pretty bowl of battery shrimp. Living life, y'all. That's what it's all about. Look at them big old shrimp. Very, very pleased with that, y'all. Very, woo, very pleased with that. Got some good ones. Uh-oh, got a squid. That's some calamari right there. Good, good shrimp. Yes, sir. Now what I try to do is I try to move everything back. Good, good croakers too, y'all. Now I'm gonna open the gate. Let some of them good old croaker go. Boy, I'd be some trout candy if I was trout fishing, y'all. Another good shrimp. We just go through like that, pick them out. You gotta watch all those catfish. Catfish will get you. There's another good shrimp. Woo, good one right there, y'all. Mmm, there's an old. Oh, there's some more calamari. Old squid. There's an old stingray hiding in there. That rascal will get you. Another good shrimp. Another big old squid. Whoa. 
Well, hello. <laughs> you hungry? <laughs> Is it feeding time, boys? Another squid. Another shrimp. Shrimp, shrimp. Ooh, big, big white, big white. Another good squid. Another good squid. Oh, we definitely gonna have some fresh calamari. Another good shrimp. Another shrimp. Another shrimp. Another shrimp. Let's give him old dolphin something to talk about. Now what I like to do is dump the shrimp back out and wash them real good. Look at those shrimp, y'all. We got some we got some hammers in here too, y'all. We got some very, very nice shrimp in there nice all right we're gonna do it the same we did last time y'all we got a tail buoy end of our net we get our net out of the box we're gonna get back here get our float and lead lines untangled Make sure all that looks good, and it does. And get our tickle chain right in between the lead lines. That's where it goes. Let it out. All right, everything looks good. It's set up. All we're gonna do now is we're gonna hook up our kill switch line bump the motor and gear that's all we're gonna do bump it in gear get our boards deploy those make sure they spread out initially we don't want them to get them tangled up that'd be nothing but a big mess now we just basically just let them out Make sure, watch your feet. Make sure your feet aren't tangled up in any uh, loops in the rope. Every now and then, grab hold of those boards, spread them out a little bit. This is the easy part. All right, we got the net out for the second drag. It's uh, 520, 30 minute drag. We'll pull it in about 550. Then we gotta make a run, get things ready for a flounder gigging charter tonight and hope this wind calms down, y'all. Ooh, it's rough out here. Stay tuned. Let's see if we can get some more shrimp. All right, y'all. It's been about 30 minutes for drag number two. Let's pull up the net and see what we got. Let's see what we got, y'all. I'm seeing some good shrimp in this one, too, y'all. A lot of catfish. See, when you tie that bag right, you can just pull it just like that. And it's untied. All right, let's see. Nice shrimp. Woo. Very, very good. Low. Very good shrimp in here, y'all. Good. 
Ooh. Yes. Nice. Nice shrimp. Oh my god. Whew. Look at that one, y'all. That's what I'm talking about. We can butterfly some of them. They so big. Alright, I'm gonna open my little trap door. I may uh, offer this as a part of a charter. If y'all would be interested in doing this, give me a call. Let me know. 251-465-1598. It's something that I could tack on to the front end of a flounder gigging trip or just do on your own. You keep the catch. And we would make uh, probably be a two hour charter. We'd make like two, like three 30 minute drags. And then our travel time, we'd make it about a two hour trip. Oh, nice one, y'all. Nice shrimp. Yes, sir. Very, very pleased with this drag. Look at that, y'all. Look at that. <laughs> 